In today's video, I'm going to be showing you the best Chrome extensions you could use for Roblox. All of these are of course 100% free and will be linked below if you want to download any of them or all of them or just one. And I also want to mention that all of these work great together. Now the first one we're going to be looking at is something called BT Roblox. And just to let you know, all these Chrome extensions are 100% safe. So back to what I was saying, BT Roblox does a ton of things. One thing that this extension is really good at doing is actually showing Robux to cash value, which to put it simply basically means what does the amount of Robux actually mean in US dollars or euros or whatever currency that you have? What does it mean in that currency? As you can see right here, this Valentine's Day 2011 cap is 3,000. 200 Robux and in real life US dollars would be $11.20. So it's just kind of a cool thing to show what real value is in Roblox and in real life. And if you go into the BT Roblox settings, you can actually access this really cool feature that not a lot of people know about where you could basically change the colors from either to the sky color, like as you can see on the edges of my screen, or you can change it to red which actually actually kind of looks good with my avatar there. And then you, of course, you have simply black, which adds this this hexagon type background with a with, with a darked out homepage. This next thing that BT Roblox does, it doesn't really add too much. It just kind of makes your avatar shop look really cool. You hover over an item like this, it, <laughs> it's kind of clipping out my head. But as you can see, it, sh it basically shows you what it would look like on your avatar without having to actually click into it and click the little try on button. This is by far the best feature that BT Roblox has added to their Chrome extension. And that is where you can actually get rid of these clunky ads by just clicking don't show ads. And by doing that, you get rid of the ads as you can see. And it, it just it just makes the home screen look so much better without any ads at all. Next one we're going to be looking at is called better Roblox friend list. If you guys haven't already noticed, my friend bar right here, which most people have right around here is gone. And it is replaced with this really clean little box that says friend list. And if I click on it, as you can see, it shows the friends that I have that are online and that are offline where I can click here and show all the offline friends. And in my opinion, it, it just really gets rid of the, the, the clunky little friends list bar that takes up space and, and just gives you more space for your games to show up. And it's just, just a really cool extension. Another cool extension to mess with your friends or mess with any YouTuber is, th there's an extension called Row Searcher. Basically what this extension does is it lets you join players that have joins off or are not showing that they're in a game. You could easily paste the username or user ID of the player and click user ID and it either shows if the player is offline or if they are in that server and if they are in a server then you could join them. If you actually want to learn how to install this Chrome extension, I actually have a video up on the channel. Make sure to go watch that if you do want to install that. Number four on the list is actually Roblox Plus, where it adds some really cool features to limited items or just items in general. A really cool feature that Roblox Plus has is it shows all the resellers and owners of an item that you're looking at, especially limited. So if you're a trader, I would definitely recommend getting this Chrome extension. Another thing that Roblox Plus has added is a filtration system for easier access to specific clothing. So let's say you've bought a ton of clothing on Roblox and want to find a specific shirt. Well, if you know the name of it, you could easily just type in the name and it'll show up in search because you get this little search bar. It's a little feature, but it helps a lot when you're creating your Roblox avatar. I'm not the kind of person that joins a lot of groups and is very active, but you might be. And if you are and want to get notified for just one community, then Roblox Plus makes that really easy. You can get group shout notifications or be only notified for selected groups. And if you're the kind of person that wants to get notified right when their friend joins Roblox, then you're in luck because Roblox Plus actually has this feature too. Another extension we're going to be looking at today is called Row Pro. You might have heard of it before. And if you haven't already noticed, my homepage looks a little bit different than yours. As you can see at the top here, I have something called Most Played Games. And it actually shows exactly when I was playing any of these games. One thing that this extension adds that no other extension could even come close to is random experience, where this could basically create a random game. You can see I have the top 50 experiences and it just randomly picked Anime Battle Arena. So we could close this and we could go back and maybe pick the top 960 experiences and throw the dice. It gives me a game, an infinite road trip. 
So if you're bored on Roblox, this is a this is a really big help. It just randomly picks any type of experience. I personally don't use this, but this is kind of a cool feature to see to see how uh, how how decked out your avatar is and how expensive and Gucci your your avatar is is really looking at the moment. My outfit cost is 150 Robux, and it shows all your currently wearing items for easier access. And now that we're on the avatar page, you probably also noticed that my my background on my avatar looks a lot different than most. You can pretty much change the background to any color you want. And it has all these cool, fun backgrounds that you can mess around with. So every time you come on this page, you will see this background. If you found this video useful at all, make sure to subscribe down below. I will see you guys in the next one. If you guys did enjoy though, or found any of this useful, make sure to subscribe. No, I think I already said that, didn't I? Did I already say that? No, I didn't already say that.